Hello, readers. As you can see, I'm in a different location today. I normally record downstairs in my basement, but today I just didn't feel like going down there. So I'm just sitting on my couch. I was doing some homework and I needed something else to do, so I thought it is the perfect time for today's book talk. Um, and today's selection is an older book. This book actually came out when I was 13, 12 or 13, so really I could have been reading this book. Um, and it is from an author that so many people know and love, and I got to meet uh, last fall fall it was in fall um, and so it is squids will be squids by john shuska um and so this book just like all of his books is just really funny and see i really this was a gift to Jonah. I was at a conference and I thought I have got to get him some books. Of course, he loves to read. Um, and most people probably know John Shizka most for the true story of the three little pigs. Um, but he has written many books. Um, he inspired me to invite men to come read in my classroom. So thank you for, uh, for coming, Mr. Miles. Um, and so this book, I think I knew about it when I was a kid, but I know that I have seen it in many classrooms. Um, it is great because it is a book of, um, we'll say new fables. Um, and as you know, fables usually are um, stories that are older, but they teach a lesson or teach some kind of value or moral about the community that they come from. And so these um, teach some things, but really a lot of them are just kind of silly. The illustrations are fantastic. Um, I was trying to look through and pick a favorite, and it was really difficult. Um, those who are in my class, we just read the amazing book uh, by Drew Daywalt, The Legend of Rock, Paper, Scissors. And as you can see, there is a different twist on rock, paper, scissors in this book, if you like um, the other one. And... I re have read this several times with Jonah, and he loves it. Even if he doesn't quite understand all of the stories, I think that the illustrations are just fun and weird enough that uh, it still really keeps him entertained. Um, and he even told me that he, even though he has it here at home, uh, he picked it up from his school library as one of his choices for the week. So I would definitely recommend any book by John Shiska, but in particular, right now I am recommending Squids Will Be Squids, Fresh Morals, Beastly Fables.